Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of the Red Dead Redemption 2 full walkthrough. Uh, if, you, uh, if you guys remember the last one, we just robbed this homestead and got a couple of bucks. So we didn't really take too much of a peek around, though, so I feel like we should uh, at least maybe loot some of these bodies, check out some of the containers. And then we're gonna... I mean, honestly... Oh, that was a little aggressive. I kind of want to maybe take a little poke around the world, you know, because I feel like we've been knock a lot, knocking out a lot of uh, uh, missions recently, and maybe it's time, oops, maybe it's time we uh, we take a look at what we're working with with the, with the world, you know what I mean? And I, I mean just go out and explore a little bit. Gunslingers, okay. And we got ten more cards to go, apparently. What was on the table? Bread chunk. Yeah, sure. We actually are kind of hungry, so... That works out nicely. Provisions. Yeah, let's eat that. Um, I'm not going to eat that raw. That's a little crazy. What else do we have for food? Not much, huh? Biscuits. A lot of carbs. We'd really be out here. Hmm. Yeah, we need some coffee, don't we? We need something that restores our stamina core. For that, I think we need some alcohol. So... Do we have any? Our stamina is already. Slowly damages have moderately restores stamina core and dead eye core. That's fine. We're a little bit more balanced out now. Let's go see what's in this house. A lot of horses here we could sell, to be fair. I mean, they're not doing anyone any good here. There might be a move. Crackers. Down here, nothing. Oh, weapon case, huh? Is that a pump shotgun? Wow, poor condition. All right. Did I have to drop one of my... Yeah, I did. I want to keep the Lancaster re repeater. Alright, um, we're going to do this. We're going to... Can I store this on my horse? Store it on the horse, and then we could... Grab the Lancaster repeater. Come on, Vigilance. Come on. There you are. This is pump action shotgun. Right, yeah, we're going to put that in there. Then we can go grab our rifle again. And did it despawn? 
Oh my god, yes it did. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that sucks. Oh, what can you do? Alright, what do we... We could, uh... Potentially... Snag one of these horses. Back here. And sell it in town. So which one's the better take? Oh, I guess I could search the saddlebags. It's a big horse. American Standard Bread. Okay. Let's, uh... Give it an old study. Handling race. Yeah, I'm taking this one. Can I lead it? I have to calm it down a little bit more. Easy, you're all right. There. Good girl. It's not like giving me the option. Why don't we, uh, we temporarily store one unbonded horse by hitching it in camp? Can I make vigilance follow me? I guess I can. Okay. Alright, so we're gonna head to... I guess we're gonna head to Valentine. Sell this horse. And then we'll go exploring. And I hate to say, but maybe we should sell Vigilance in exchange for this horse. This horse might even be a better option. Then again, we are bonded to Vigilance, so... All these animals around make me want to shoot them. There's town. a good choice, Jake. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Evening, fella. Evening. Vigilance, come on. What, you get tripped up by the rocks? Let's go. Come on, boy. Ooh, bouncy bridge. Oh, God. 
There's a lot of weight on that bridge right then. <laughs> Probably damn near 2,500 pounds. Or more. Okay, it's a brisk, brisk evening in Valentine, 43 degrees. And there's uh, Mary's house, or at least the house she's staying in. Okay, we made it. Only five Nobody bucks. That overnight. There's room in the stable. Um, if you ain't got papers, I can't give you much. I've been burned before. Oh, uh, yeah, we don't have the papers for the horse, that's why it's not. <sighs> Let's see. Info time female. That's the American Standard Breed Vigilance. What is it? Vigilance. It has those yellow marks. Tennessee Walker. Hmm. It's faster, I think. Then. Yeah, I think it's the best one. I hear folks say this town is on the skids, but I don't see it. It's stable vigilance. Try out the American Standard Breed for a while. Um, I mean, it's really not worth selling if we're only going to get five bucks out of it, so... Why not try it out and see how it compares to old Vigi Boy? All right. Um, I guess we'll see what we could do. My daddy was a blacksmith, right here in this shop. We do have a lot of money now, so. Best to have a good saddle that'll hold up. Well, let's pace ourselves here. Uh. Type of mane do we want? Some grooming goes a long way. Looks nice. Short mane. Uh, screw it. Let's go with long mane. Let's try it out. I'd steer clear of the wind folk in this town. These either too churchy or liable to get you itchy. Tail time. Nice bit of grooming. People take notice. That's a good looking horse now. It's a little peculiar looking with the the white and the, the coat color. But, you know. Alright. Has to be a girl name because we know it's a female. Um, for some reason, the first. First name that came into my mind was Penelope. So I think that's what we're going to go with. If I can spell it. Penel. 
There we go. <laughs> Thank God for uh took care of their horses like you. So its name is Penelope now. Could not go back. That's a good name for a horse. Penelope. Got him. Okay, anything else you want to do? I mean, we do got a ton of money, so... Let's, uh... Look at the saddles. Good saddles is almost as important as a good horse. Ash and coffee. Walnut and natural. Oh, that's pretty cool. That's a good choice. Better Let's go. the saddle, better the ride. Let's get some bigger saddle bags. Always good to have one of those. Nice. You only live once, lest you're a cat. <laughs> Lest you're a cat. That's a nice addition on a saddle. That's pretty cool. Diablo horn. What would be most comfortable in the hand, huh? Probably not that. It's all yours. Blankets. I got one of them myself. Got one of them blankets yourself? That works. Always Padded. good to have one of those. Yeah, we're good with that. Alright, Penelope, looks like you're ready for the road. Uh got some hay. Okay. I don't know what I think about the white mane yet, but we'll we'll uh we'll try it out for a while. All right. All right. And <laughs> not good. Oh, there's a bounty as well. That's great. Let's uh, let's take a look at the bounty. I'm not saying we're gonna do it in this episode or the next, but at least so we can have it marked on the map for when we do get time. Oh my God! If I ain't mistaken, you're looking for a bounty. Look no further than that wall, son. We really busted that door down, didn't we? Okay. Well, it looks like trouble, all right. A reward for $25 will be paid for the arrest of Eliane Swan, wanted for the crime of matricide. The above amount will be paid immediately for the delivery of the prisoner. Wanted alive. She has been seen in the Cumberland Falls area. We were just up there. The unknown male who may, may be manipulating her. Hmm. All right. That one. They say she's sleeping rough near Cumberland Falls. And what's more, they say she ain't sleeping alone. No, oh, I got it. So they got a feller with them. With her. That is. Okay. Um, what do I want to do? 
What's the move here? Do we want to spend a night in Valentine? I think so. So I don't want to go venturing out in the middle of the dark. But come morning, I want to explore. I guess up there, there's not really much to see up here. But screw it. I guess we could, where my cursor is right now, we'll take a look at this area that we haven't been to yet. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to leave Penelope here. I'm going to go to the bar. So that's what cowboys do. Ah. Oh, hello. Uh oh, mister. Fellers? Fellers? Hey, mister. Table's growing Guys, how's it going? Hey, yo. Howdy, mister. Hey there, mister. Partner? Hey. Got your work cut out for you tonight. Oh. <laughs> Whatever that means. What's it to be? Uh, I actually don't know what we. Uh... Let's get a couple drinks. Sure. I don't think we're very hungry. We did. Uh... We did eat at that homestead we were at. You know it, Mr. Barkeep. You know it. Drown the sorrows. Look away. Look away, you great big bloody girl. Who are you talking to? I'll kill you. I'll kill all of you. Hello, you I, I ain't man. afraid of none of you, not one. Oh boy. What do we got? Quarters in on the cut in the cut? I'll have uh whatever you like. like being Always worth having one for the road. Isn't that the truth? Are we gonna take the shot or what? <laughs> oh, well, I guess that'll do us. We're good. Just well, okay, me. take it easy. You're a fool. Whoa, okay. I don't want to shoot people. I don't... I don't want to shoot people. I don't know why every time I try to take a swing at someone, I pull... Alright, yeah, let's, let's, uh... Everyone's leaving now. You don't need to leave, people. It's okay. Howdy, ma'am. What is Howdy, big boy. Big boy. Uh. Having a slow night. Hmm. Whatever. I don't know, Arthur's thinking about maybe hiring a lady. Let's see. Feel like having a good time right now? Mm. Decline or reject? That's our only options. Decline or reject. Guess you don't want a good time. Apologize for the old drunk. There was only two I always say manners cost nothing. Really? Your breath's so bad, it's damn near curling my hair. Ew. I'm just, I'm just confused why there was only two options. Or only one option. I could either decline or I could refuse. Or reject. The damn government is taking people Those are the same thing. Messing with their minds and turning them on their own families. Imagine that. Well, hello, handsome. Oh, I'm what yeah. you call handsome, huh? Hey, good looking. You looking for a good time? Uh. What? Not today. 
Alright, maybe later then. Cause these are all the the girls that you guys hire, huh? Find out. You know, smoking's bad for your health. My, my, my. Am I lucky I ran into you? Are you in the mood for some fun? How come... How come I can't say yes? I ain't that desperate. Stop it already. You best hold that nonsense down. This is weird. This is weird stuff. I was actually thinking about spending the night with one of those girls, but I don't have the ability to say yes, so it seems. Hey there, cowboy. Maybe another day, darling. I got some exploring to do. Alright, Penelope. Let's get her going. Okay, so. Let's make a marker out there. That's our waypoint. And we will travel for a good while. Let's see what we may run across. We still do got a bunch of animal pelts on our back here. Probably should sell. Probably should have sold when we were in town. We're doing a little bit of tactical scouting. Fort Wallace and Valentine, okay. Valentine that way. Yep. Looking for any new signs. I don't reckon we've been to this part of the world yet. really interesting in sight though. Yep. Now. Wapati reservation? So that's ooh, Indians. Bacchus Bridge, Bacchus Bridge, Emerald Ranch. That's gonna say Valentine. Okay, so we got an Indian reservation on this way, so this should be exciting. something fierce think you could give me a ride you're the lady from the meme aren't you yeah sure <laughs> hop on oh thank you sir thank you i don't know if you guys know what i'm talking about but there's a meme where she's like oh my horse you know up and dad on me oh, taking me there 
Pull on my way, ma'am. Like the exact opposite you. way. Huh. I raised that horse, you know. Raised it since it was just a foal. Oh, uh, losing a horse is hard. Sorry to hear that. Yeah, that horse did right by me. Better than my husband, truth be told. That fool, always complaining. But does he do something about it? Man barely lifts his hand to wave the flies away. Aside from to lift a drink, of course. Marriage, for me, has been nothing but trouble. But Biscuit? He was a fine animal. Loyal, smart, brave. Didn't take no guff, not from no one. Had one of them mountain boys pull a gun on me once? I was riding up near the Dakota and had stopped by a nice warm patch. Must have dozed off, but I wake up and find some nasty piece of work pointing a rusty shotgun straight at me. Well, he gets wheezing on and I must have made some sort of noise because the next thing I know, Biscuit had nipped his ear clean off. Kicked his hide too as he was hollering away. Didn't think a man could run so fast. Oh yeah? Yeah, had a good laugh on that one. <laughs> I tell the husband, what does he do? Should have never gone over there, honey, he says. Gee, thanks. <laughs> So, you live at Emerald Ranch then? For the time being. I was looking for work. They was looking for some help with the gardens. If I waited any longer for my husband to put food on the table, I'd have died of starvation. I'll be moving on soon, though. Emerald Ranch, well, it's a strange place. How so? The owner's a mean bastard. Strange, too. Delights in bullying folk. There's a daughter, but she never leaves the house. You can see her in the window sometimes. When I asked about her, everybody told me to leave it alone. Found an old saloon there, all shut down now, but I went in to have a look, and there's bullet holes, old blood stains. Something definitely happened there, but I couldn't figure it. Just an uncomfortable feeling to the place. Either way, it's time I left. Especially now I lost that poor horse. I'll collect my belongings and be on my way. Back home? I guess. I bet my husband's right where I left him. Bottle in hand. It really do be like that sometimes, ma'am. Yeah. Oh, we're getting close now. Getting close. You know, you're a real big inconvenience to me, miss. <laughs> but what am I gonna do? Here we go. This is great. This was kind of you, mister. Yeah, off you Please, go. Take this as my way of thanking you. A ring. <laughs> Silver and Appreciate emblem. it. <sighs> what a lousy day. All right. See ya. <laughs> Dang. Scared her. Hey, you're okay, girl. Wow, she's really flipping out, huh? There, girl. All right, guys. I'm gonna end this, I'm gonna end this episode here. In the next one, we'll see what uh, this new form part of the map has in store for us. So, if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like and subscribe. Check out some of the other.